Welcome back everyone. So today we are back with another puzzle known as the hourglass puzzle. Let's see what the problem statement says. You are given two hourglasses of four minutes and seven minutes each. This is the hourglass of seven minutes and this is the hourglass of four minutes. And your task is you have to measure nine minutes using these two hour glasses of seven minutes and four minutes. So pause the video, think of the answer and comment it down in the comment section. So moving to the solution. Initially in the start, that is at t equals zero minutes, what we will do, we will start both the hour glasses at the same time, that is we will flip both the hour glasses, the seven minute hour glass as well as the four minute hour glass will flip both of them. Then what will happen exactly after four minutes? We will notice that at t equals four minutes, the four minute hour glass has completely run out. This hour glass has completely run out and the seven minute hour glass has been left with three minutes of sand. Now, since the four minute hour glass has been completely run out, so we will flip this hour glass once again at t equals four minutes. That is flip the four minute hour glass and remember the fact that three minute of sand is still left on one side of the seven minute hour glass. Now let's see what will happen exactly after three minutes that is at t equals seven minutes. So we notice that at t equals seven minutes, the four minute hour glass is left with one minute of sand on one side and filled with three minutes of sand on the other side. And we notice that the seven minute hour glass has been completely run out. That is one side is empty and one side is filled with seven minutes of sand. So what we will do, we will flip the seven minute hour glass this time at t equal to seven minutes. Now what we observe, we observe that after exactly one minute that at t equals eight minutes, the four minute hour glass completely runs out because it was left with one minute of sand in the earlier case. And we observe that the seven minute hour glass is filled with six minutes of sand on one side and one minute of sand on the other side. Now notice the fact that we have already measured t equal to eight. That is we have already measured eight minutes so far. So we initially had to measure nine minutes. So we are just one minute away from the final answer. And one minute of sand is left on one side of the seven minute hourglass. So we will flip the seven minute hourglass again this time. That is at t equals eight minutes flip the seven minute hour glass and we notice that at t equals nine minutes, the seven minute hour glass becomes empty on the above side and gets filled with seven minutes of sand on the other side. And the four minute hour glass was completely empty on one side and already filled with four minutes of sand on the other side since the previous case. Hence the total time elapsed in the total process is nine minutes. Hence we have successfully measured nine minutes so far using the two hour glasses of four minutes and seven minutes each by flipping of seven and four minute hour glasses one by one in a specific order. So I hope that every one of you might have understood the concept of how to measure nine minutes exactly using two hour glasses of seven minutes and four minutes respectively. So thank you for being a wonderful audience. Like the video, subscribe to the channel if you have not subscribed yet and stay connected for future videos.